Hey guys, how you doing out there tonight in YouTube? I hope you guys are keeping cool because the temperatures here in Bronx, New York are 100 degrees, scorching. This day has been unbelievable, guys. But anyway, enough about that. This video is based on the iPhone 4. I'm gonna do a quick review. I purchased this phone on launch day on June 24th. And I gotta tell you guys, it was well worth the wait. I got online like at five in the morning. As soon as the mall opened up, the people swarmed into the store. It was hectic, it was crazy. But I had this puppy in my hands at about uh, 10 o'clock. So I waited online for five hours. It was not bad at all. Apple knows how to make things uh, fun. They, they actually gave us free t-shirts. They was giving us free water. Starbucks was there giving out free coffee. It was an experience. I mean, the bunch of uh, Apple employees came out at 7 o'clock and the store opened up and started high-fiving everybody, started screaming. So it was an experience, guys. I never waited online for any phone and believe me, it was, it was an experience. It was a good experience. But enough about that. Um, there's a review on the iPhone 4. And there's a few new features on the phone, guys. Uh, you've probably seen all the videos already on YouTube. But I wanted to put my, my own special little twist to the video. And the first thing Apple hyped upon is the Retina display. Now, the Retina display, guys, is amazing. I don't know how many of you guys have seen this phone in person. If you haven't seen it, take a trip to the local Apple store, play with the phone, and check out. Because this video is not going to do it justice, guys. It's something that you have to see with your bare eyes, bare naked eyes. I mean, it's, the resolution is what, 960 by 640 on this phone? Amazing, guys. So it's the highest resolution on any phone in the market as of today. So um, check it out. The next uh, feature is the little camera you see here on the upper left hand, the front facing camera, upper left hand corner. Now, Apple introduced us to FaceTime. What is FaceTime? Well, me and my boy are able to look at each other. Me and my father are able to look at each other visually through the phone. It's something amazing. It's something that I spoke with a good friend of mine from long distance the other day. And we spoke for two hours. And that does not even hinder. When you're on FaceTime, it does not hinder your rate plan. So it's amazing. You could talk and talk and talk and don't need to worry about your minutes. It doesn't, trust me, it doesn't affect it one bit. So take a look at FaceTime, guys. I wish I could show you right now, but um, that'll do. Uh, I'll do another video on FaceTime and another later video. All right, guys. So let's take a look at the back. And as we notice in the back is a brand new camera. And this camera, yes, is five megapixel. I know many of you are like blah blah blah. There's other phones in the market right now with an eight megapixel camera. But trust me, this camera takes second place to none of those phones. Um, I took a a bunch of videos I have taken a bunch of pictures and it is amazing it's a huge upgrade from the 3GS guys it, I mean if you, any of you had the 3GS and upgraded to the iPhone 4 trust me you guys are definitely or have definitely noticed the clearer and more crisper and the more vibrant colors that are on your pictures and in your videos it's amazing it's amazing and also what was much needed on this cam on this uh, phone is the LED flash now I've taken videos in complete darkness and this camera is I mean this LED flash is amazing it lights up the whole room it's super bright so it does help I do I'm, I'm somebody who takes a lot of pictures I'm somebody who doesn't like to be carrying around with a digital camera I want to have my phone and I want my phone to do every function possible so uh, Apple did a great job of, inst of uh, the addition of the LED and the new camera what else here yeah, I know a lot of you guys, I've seen a lot of the videos on on this right here, on the antenna, that the reception, you can't cover it. I gotta tell you guys, I don't have that problem. Uh, I'm not saying it doesn't exist, but I could hold my phone like this, I could hold my phone without the case, and my uh, reception does not go down a bit. Maybe I'm one of the lucky ones, but hey, uh, a lot of people saying put on a, a cover, and those issues will will be no more so i um, look into a few covers uh, the much recommended uh, Apple bumper case is one that's much hyped upon right now that's pretty good for that if you're having those reception issues take a look into that okay guys so um, also another added feature that they instilled is the a big battery 
Now I gotta tell you, this is huge. It was definitely huge for me because I was having issues with my 3GS. My battery was down like midway through the day. I was pushing all the push notifications, all my email, um, surfing and checking. Uh, I, I was just having issues. I text a lot. I, I used my phone constantly. Um, and I was just having issues. Now with my new battery life, it's helped me tremendously. I, I'm able right now to go a day and a half on battery life on the new iPhone 4. Amazing, guys. But uh, Apple did a great job with the, app, with the battery. And um, let me show you this, guys. The much hype addition as well to the phone is the... I don't know how many guys you, you have heard about the gyroscope. Much added feature. It's, it's mainly for the developers they, in producing these games. I have a game right here by NG Moco. It's called uh, Eliminate Gun Range. There's like, I think, two or three games right now that enable the gyroscope feature. Alright, so you pick um, your gun. I'm on level three right now, guys. This one's a little hard. But let me adjust the camera for you guys. Let me see if you guys can focus. Alright, so what this pretty much does, the gyroscope feature, is you're able to look up and down. So... On the 3GS, you was able to go left and right. Well, now you're able to go up and down. So as you can see, guys, I totally suck at this game. That's why I'm only on level 3. But it's alright, guys. I'm just showing you the feature right now. Alright, guys. So that's my review right now of the iPhone 4. If, guys, if you, if you don't have the phone and you're looking for a phone that's fun, a phone that's that you're going to enjoy... I never was into cell phones till I started messing around with the first iPhone and it just took off from there guys. I messed with the Sprint HTC, the Evo, the Web OS and all these Palm Pre uh, and really I can't get into those phones guys. I really can't. So this phone has done it for me. Maybe it hasn't done it for a bunch of you guys. You're going to call me Apple Fanboy, you're going to call me this and that but it, it's what appeals to you. So. If you want to check it out, go to the local app store, borrow it from a friend if you know somebody who has it, and check it out for yourself. A lot of good features on the new phone. I'm happy with it. Now, guys, um, I'm going to be uploading a few more videos. I know I've been slow in, in pushing out these videos. I've been working kind of hard, running back and forth. But please, guys, follow me on Twitter, Martin168. Um, hit me up on YouTube, any comments, anything you want me to put out. I'm more than happy to, to listen to you guys. I'm, and um, guys, well, I hope you guys have a good night. Stay cool out there, scorching hot. And uh, peace. Later, guys. You guys have a good night. Stay cool out there, scorching hot. And um, peace. Later, guys.